Hello, El Luchadors! Welcome back to Restless! El Restlesso here! <laughs> I'm not gonna do an accent. Uh, hello everyone! <laughs> and welcome back to a wrestling game! A wrestling game on the Restless channel. Would you look at that? And I'm, as you can see, I am in full wrestling attire. El Restlesso is here. To service you with wonderful gameplay in the form of SmackDown vs. Raw 2008. Yes! 2008! Let me quickly update the fucking... ...category. And then we'll be good to go. But yes, it has been a little bit since we have... ...performed with a wrestling game to actually play. We've always sort of wandered into the first-person shooter route and cult games and all that sort of stuff. And I don't think I'm going to wear this mask for the entirety of it because it is very tight. But yes, we are playing some SmackDown vs. Raw. I used to play this game a lot back in the day. Um, I used to play it on the PSP though, which was a different experience, but still a fun one nonetheless. Um, I would highly recommend it. <laughs> If you are into wrestling games at all, uh, SmackDown vs. Raw is a pretty good one. Like, you can go back, you can go back to 06, 07, and 08. I think these three are solid entries to go back and play. Um, yeah. SVR, in general, I think was a good time period for wrestling games. They kind of dropped off over the years, and you'll see where they do. And I think eventually we will get to some of those less than stellar games but today we're going to be creating a new wrestler and this wrestler you might be familiar with it's from the oscar nominated film the wrestler mickey rourke ladies and gentlemen mickey he's not here but mickey rourke we're going to be making mickey rourke um mickey the mouse rourke uh we're gonna i'm gonna judge from photos and things like that try and get some form of uh idea of what mickey rourke looks like um and hopefully bring that into the smackdown versus raw universe so let's go to creator modes we're going to create a wwe superstar hottest free agent mickey rourke I have this on PC, psp yeah i used to have it on psp it was fucking rad I I had all of them on uh, PSP. I only I had I think I had 06, 07, 08 and then I stopped buying PSP games and then bought a uh, I bought SmackDown vs Raw 2009 for the Wii. Uh and then I kind of took a break for a while. <laughs> Didn't play wrestling games all the way until like WWE 13. So I I missed out on 2010, 2011 and WWE 12. But I don't know. I wasn't really into wrestling at that point. I kind of, I kind of gave up on it. Let's go, new WWE superstar. There he is, ECW legend Tommy Dreamer. I should have taped the wrists. You know, I should have done that. I should have really went all hawk here. All right. So we do have templates. This kind of looks like Charlie Haas right now, uh, from World's Greatest Tag Team or uh, Rico Constantino. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna put the mask up here because <laughs> it's it's like bulging on my chin it's really fucking hurting okay it just looks like a weird cap now that's fine um but all right let's I'm gonna bring up I'm gonna try and get an image of Mickey Rock from the wrestler so he was Randy the Ram. Robinson. Randy the Ram Robinson? I think that was his name. I could be wrong. Yeah, it was. So, Randy the Ram Robinson. There he is. Oh, a lot of these photos. He basically looks like Jerry Lynn. <laughs> but that's alright. So, he's got kind of lime green long trunks. And just kind of white elbow pads, white knee pads, uh, lime green boots, a bit of a pattern on the trunks. 
but he seems to consistently wear the same trunks throughout the movie and long blonde hair so this is very jerry lynn yeah jerry lynn jerry lynn hair um very good here's some photos of him jumping around all bloodied very nice all right well let's give it a go um, he also comes out to the ring in a fur waistcoat. Interesting. A fur waist. It looks like a sheepskin waistcoat. Okay, let's start with the facial features. Or we could... Uh, no. Let's start with hair. Alright, so clearly long hair is where we're going here. I want to see if there's any other options that we can choose. That is the Red Rooster. Uh, <laughs> let me have a look. It wasn't a mullet. It was kind of just long blonde hair. Ooh, it's a little bit like that, I guess. That's more of a mullet. Nah, it's just more like... Ooh, actually. That's kind of him after a match. I'd say this is normal, though. So let's go that one. All right, so we want some nice, it was kind of bleach blonde. So let's go custom color. And let's try and get a really pale blonde if we can. Ideally, I, I want him to, he, the way Randy the Ram was in that film, he was basically an 80s wrestler who had, who was washed up completely. Um, so, you know, drug addiction and all. Uh, this fucking spectrum thing is not working very well. I might have to shade. Oh, there we go. That's what I want. Now we go the yellow. Now we get the bleach blonde. Well, that's a bit too yellow. A little bit lighter. That's a little bit greenish. It's very, it's it's very platinum blonde. Like it's extremely fake blonde. It almost looks like ramen hair. If you ever watch like Dolph Ziggler wrestle. <laughs> It, he, he's after a while in the ring his hair turns to ramen um, at least when he was a blonde he doesn't have that anymore but yeah kind of like that maybe a little bit more yellow you know what, I'd say that's pretty good is that oh that's just length you know what it is pretty long it was actually decent length hair it's clipping in, but that's fine. Alright. So we have hair. Head morphing, head. He's got a very large forehead. Let's widen that head a little bit. That's head height. Oh god, this is weird. Okay, sure. <laughs> the forehead. Alright. Big forehead. Solid forehead on him. Yeah. Something like that. Width. Okay. Is it one with more of a receding hairline? <laughs> Because that's, that's the idea, is that he was, he did have a receding hairline. These are all female cuts, but they actually kind of work a little bit. Hold on. Um, that's kind of it. I don't know. What was our alternative option? Ooh. No. <laughs> I 
It was either that or that. Nah. You know what? It's kind of more that, but we'll stick with what we had. That's fine. Face. So eyes. What are we working with here? Kind of beady eyes. Yeah, he's got kind of some beady little eyes. Is he blue-eyed? It doesn't matter. <laughs> I don't care. Eyelashes, eyebrows. Ooh, a raised eyebrow. He's got kind of the... Well, these are some interesting combinations here. I'm going to say pencil-thin eyebrows. Uh, and whatever brown. That'll do. Mouth, lips... He's got some big fucking lips on him. He's got fucking boxer lips. Like someone's repeatedly busted his lip over the years. Uh, he was a boxer at one point, I'm pretty sure, Mickey Rock. So this isn't too far off out of his realm. I need to raise my chair. <laughs> Very low. Um, yeah, these are some just real puckery lips. Real fucking... Ooh, yeah. That's looking a little bit like him. Uh, no lipstick. I think he's good there. Teeth, doesn't matter. Skin. He's got very leathery skin. Very leathery skin. Facial features. This is a bunch of bullshit. <laughs> Yeah, that's... Nah. Marks. I don't think he had any facial facial marks. There's a close-up. Nah. He was okay in that department. He was relatively clean. Ooh. That's looking a little bit closer. It's a real leathery face. That's close. It's very close. It's definitely one of these. That might be a bit... That might be a bit too leathery. <laughs> Ooh. I think we might have a winner. Ooh, I don't know. We'll go with that one. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, custom color. Maybe shade? Yeah, it's lighter, it's darker, that's too dark. He's kind of specular I don't know. whoa holy shit he's like shiny does that just mean baby oil <laughs> it just means he has extra virgin baby oil uh that's fine skin aging oh yeah he's old <laughs> he's very old Leathery, like I said. Face morphing. Okay, we're getting real deep here. Again, beady eyes. Beady eyes. Kind of small eyes, yeah. Yeah, that'll do. Nose, he had kind of a... Kind of a roundish nose. Uh, maybe width. Yeah, 
It, I'm not going to say it's Triple H nose, but it's it's close. It is a little bit close to Hunter Hearst Helmsley nose. Schnozzle. Uh, more so in the width, though. Um, um, bring that up a little bit. Ooh. Yeah. Well, maybe a little bit low. <laughs> Looked a little bit weird. All right, yeah. That's good. That's good. Uh, cheeks. Ah. Maybe a little bit wider. Nah, he's fine. Most of it's pretty fine. Thickness. That's a thick mouth. Oh yeah, that's a thick mouth. Jaw. Strong jaw. Very strong jaw. Kind of. That'll do. Ears, you can't really see them. Alright. No facial hair. No makeup. Tattoos. At least I don't think he has tattoos. No, he doesn't. He's pretty clean. No face paint. No piercings. Okay. So that's the face. Now, the height, I think he is a he's between a great Carly and a Rey Mysterio I'm gonna say he's he's a little bit shorter I wouldn't say he's that tall he's very average height you know what's the average height from how old tall is fucking Mickey Rock does anyone have the how tall have they got 1.8 1.8. Okay. Really? He's 1.8. Okay. We'll leave it there. Um, uh, body type. You know what, I really don't think there's much I could do in that department. I think he's pretty stock standard in terms of body type. He's got a good bod. In the film, he's got a decent bod. Um, I don't think there's much I could really do with it. You can maybe make the shoulders a little bit wider. That's a little bit too wide. Something like that. Yeah. Otherwise, it's pretty much that. Definition. Maybe a bit more oldish. See if there's like an aged version. These all kind of look the same, to be honest. <laughs> uh. Oh god. Uh not that bad. Yeah, let's get that one. Uh no scars. Lower body, fine. That's cool. Voice very raspy. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Match specialty. Well, he does do a he does do a a death match in the movie. I think he could easily go a hardcore match. Like that's his special. He fucking loves that. Uh yeah, he's a hardcore wrestler. He's also a brawler. His signs uh <laughs> Uh Oh, these are all just 
Uh, he maybe had a stint in ECW that not too many people know about. You don't scare me. And my life, my wife thinks I'm bowling. It's mullet time. Perfect. Finalize. Uh, ring appearance. Uh, can we actually do clothing? Yes, we can. So, no headwear. Uh, upper body. He's just got some... Nope. None of these. Armwear. He's got elbow, uh, elbow pads on both arms. And those are just white ones. Mm, they look like that. Yeah, they look like that, but white. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, he's got... Uh, he does have wrist tape. That's odd. He's got like a... He's got like wrist tape, and then he's got extra wrist tape. On one arm. So one arm is like... Not like that, but kind of... Eh. Maybe... Maybe like that. <laughs> yeah, one of them is kind of like that. Just make that white. And then the other arm... Um, is just like standard wrist tape. If that's... It's like that, but white. There you go. And... Does he have anything on the hands? He's got nothing on the hands. Um... Okay, I think he's good there. Lower body. Uh, bottoms. Nope. Wrestling tights. So he's got some sexy wrestling tights. Some hot and bothered wrestling tights. My god, that is actually a visual... It's kind of like a, a an optical illusion a little bit. <laughs> Okay, let's start with that. Let's go the color. It's lime green. Uh, it's going to have to be a custom color. Lime green, which is an odd choice. Okay. And then a little bit brighter. Ooh, not that bright. Ooh, I think we're close. Yeah, around there. I don't know what alpha or length. No, length is fine. I think that's about as close as we'll get. It's kind of an odd shade of green. I don't know why it's green, because he's, he's a ram. Like, his nickname's the ram. I guess that's just the color he chose. Interesting choice. Unless it's more this side. Yeah, it's more this side. <laughs> I, I want to get his tights correct. I, I want to do it justice. For Mickey. This is just for Mickey. Oh, it's 
say that's pretty close. All right. Beautiful. Uh, pattern. I don't think patterns are going to work from this instance. Logos. Design. It's like a fucking... What are his trunks? They've got like a ram, like a logo of a ram. And then it's kind of like a bunch of... Oh, it has to be both legs, not just one. He's got like a bunch of bullshit on it. <laughs> Alright, which one of these looks like a ram? That kind of looks like a ram. We'll say that's a ram. Because there's not going to be a RAM logo in this. Okay. Up. Oh, okay. Oh, this is so annoying. I don't like how this is controlling. Nope. That's kind of it. I don't know. Sure. And it's white. <laughs> And then left leg is kind of the same thing. Again, we're just going to say this is a ram. Come on. Rotate around. Oh my god. <laughs> this is... This is a nightmare to control. Yeah, whatever. That's kind of it. It's a bad right. White. <laughs> okay. And then... He does have more shit on it. I don't really want to bother. <laughs> It's a lot of nonsense, though. I'll put it that way. It's a lot of just... It's just a weird pattern. That's all it really is. Which I don't think we can really do... Realistically. Color... Uh, that's actually kind of close. Hold on, that pattern actually might work. This pattern might work. It's actually kind of close to what it actually looks like. Kind of close. Let's say there. Alright, there's our Randy the Ram. Alright, knee pads, both knees, just standard fucking knee pads. Yeah, that. White. <laughs> uh, and then boots is just... Does he wear white boots? Oh, for fuck's sake, he's got green boots. What even? Footwear. Boots. Uh, they're kind of small boots, actually. Smallish boots. Yeah, they're kind of like those. Although they kind of look like Doc Martens. 
He doesn't wear Doc Martens, that's for sure. So let's not do Doc Martens. Alright, fuck it, we'll just do those. And then we'll try and match the colour. <laughs> Oh, what? You can only do... What the hell? You can only do one colour. Well, they're not it. You have got smaller boots? This is terrible. What am I meant to put my Randy in? He looks terrible, but that is actually what he wears. It's kind of, it's just these weird, like, lime green boots. I don't know. It's odd. Very odd. Okay. This is terrible, by the way. God awful. He looks terrible. <laughs> he looks shit. Okay. Uh, that's it, I think. In terms of looks... That's all we can really do. There's our Randy the Ram. Let's finalize. Uh, entrance appearance is going to be the same. Let's pose for a photo. Can we... Oh, we can't do a... There you go. Continue. Perfect. Alright, his name, uh, nope, nope, where is Backspace Escape, no, there we go, Caps, Randy, Uh, Randy, Randy Orton, uh, Randy, <laughs> the Ram, literally, oh wait, whoops, hold on, we'll put a, oh, that's not, what? <laughs> they don't have another one of these. Ah, oh, whatever. They don't have the reverse one of those. Randy the Ram. Oh, I hate how this keyboard is laid out. Robinson. Beautiful. Enter. <laughs> Randy the Ram Robinson. What's his name? The Ram, of course. His nickname's The Ram. Space. Ram. He's got way too much RAM. Nickname placement. Middle. Oh wait, if that's... okay. Then I need to get rid of here. Because it's going to double up. Randy Robertson, the RAM, middle. HUD name. Uh... Randy. <laughs> Robinson. Uh, 
Robinson. Oh shit, we're out of space. Randia. <laughs> there we go. Superstar. Nope, he is. Uh, Randall Keith Orton. There's no option for Randy. What the hell? There's a Randy Orton in this game. Is there any the Ram? No, there is not. Ugh. He can be then Raymond. That's close. The professional. It all it's almost wrestler. Wait, is there one for wrestler? Damn it. <laughs> I was just gonna say the wrestler. The superstar is close. Hometown. Where's he from? The Queen. He could be the Queen. Where's he from? Hold on. Because he has like a location. Where does he hail from? New Jersey. Okay. He's from New Jersey. Poor bastard. Uh. Jersey City? Sure. He's a heavyweight. He's a babyface all, all through and through. He's from ECW. <laughs> uh, nah, he's from Raw. Submit application. Alright. My chair keeps lowering because this is what it does. Perfect. We have our wrestler. Um, in terms of, I don't know if I'm gonna do all the move set stuff. I think I might just pick a template um, for the move set because we do need to create sort of something for him. Create a move set. But I feel like I'm just going to use a template and just call it because I'm not going to fucking spend 10 hours creating a moveset. Randy Robinson. Auto setting. Preset movesets. Oh, Chris Benoit is not in this game, is he? No, this would have. No, this came out after the death. <laughs> this came out after the death or the murders, so. <laughs> Because he's his moveset is kind of Chris Benoit like, a little bit. Oh, we can only pick all round. Okay, well he's an all rounder. Uh, all, yes. Finisher. I'll just do all. And then finisher, maybe we can do... Oh, he's got a diving moonsault. No, his his finisher should be a... It's kind of a diving headbutt. Um, I'm assuming it's here. Uh, diving... Diving elbow drop, fist drop, leg drop... Diving Moonsault. Ooh, no, nah, I think they took it out. Maybe they don't have it. Unless it's like under top rope. Yeah, I don't think they have it. There might there might have been a reason why they took it out. <laughs> There, there might be a very good reason why they took out the diving headbutt. I'm sure there is a good one. Diving crossbody. 
we can say it's what can you do just do a diving diving elbow diving elbow drop that one I guess can I preview these preview yeah it'll do <laughs> and then I don't know what the hell's a mat slam nah that's terrible spear there he goes ass out beautiful spear alright he can do a spear alright that's it <laughs> That's all. Beautiful. So I think he's good. I think he's all good. Um, we didn't create an entrance. We could go that far as well. There's a lot of things we can do. Potentially create an entrance. But I'm not actually sure if we should. Yeah, alright, why not? <laughs> <laughs> why not uh, just an easy creation I can't remember what song he comes out to I think he comes out to Guns N' Roses or something like that in the film we can't play that it's just some 80s tune because there's him coming out him and uh, Marissa Tomei's character there he is. <laughs> so stupid. Uh, oh, God. Gregory Helms. Uh, Marcus Corvon? What does he look like? He just kind of comes out looking cool. Nah. It's, it's very babyface. Oh, no. It's a very babyface entrance. Tommy Dreamer. Oh my god, it is literally Tommy Dreamer. It has to be. This is all he is. Crying in front of the fans all the time. That is Tommy Dreamer to a T. Randy the Ram Robinson. Yeah, this yeah, that's him. It's yep, it's Tommy Dreamer. Uh, champion Tommy Dreamer it's all Dreamer I don't have Terry Funk unlocked it would it would be Terry Funk but Tommy Dreamer also yeah just all Tommy Dreamer easy continue <laughs> what the fuck am I wearing I'm wearing a Rey Mysterio mask. But I took it off because it was getting annoying. <laughs> so it's now just like a weird hat. Turn to creation menu. Yes. Alright. We're playing a wrestling game, Drifty. Come on, man. <laughs> we'll say, how you going, Drifty? Alright. Let's start. I've got to get into gear if I'm, if I'm playing wrestling games. Save successful. Mm. Alright, so what I thought we would do is play the 24-7 mode. Um, the 24-7 mode... In this game, it's kind of like a split between GM and story mode. Uh, we'll go normal. Um, yeah, it's kind of a weird split, which is fine. Uh, ooh, original, well, it doesn't matter. 
Yeah, it's kind of like a, a weird mix between GM and story mode. So there's cutscenes, there's that sort of shit. Mm. Let me go play with my friend when we have a day off school. Oh, nice. Good for you, dude. All right, my Nokia 3310 is blowing up. Coach just sent me an email. Uh, yep, that all looks good. Sure, I'm on Raw. Okay, calendar. It's my day off. Uh, the options are there. Subtitles, I'll turn those on. Yes. Save. Perfect. All right, I believe there is an opening cutscene. I do vaguely remember playing this like a little bit, but I, I really don't think I played this too much. Um, I guess we'll simulate those days. Match one. Hell yeah. All right, let's face Shad on Sunday Night Heat. Let's go, Randy. Shad Gaspard. Beautiful. Oh, it didn't give me Tommy Dreamer's entrance movie. There he is. The wrestler. Randy the Ram Robinson. Beautiful. And his gear is all custom made. From the finest tailors in New Jersey. Oh, Shad's gonna get it. But yes, also rest in peace, Shad. He was a lovely human. Seems like a really cool guy. But also, we're going to beat him in this match right now. Yo, 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 yo. God. It's prime time. And the opponent. There it is. From Brooklyn, New York, weighing in at 280 pounds, Shad. Bundava. I like it. His own local wrestling promotion. All these Matt facts. <laughs> this is V1 Matt. I really don't care. Okay. Classic intro tune. Yeah, it is. Come on, Randy. You know what? I should have made him more tanned. He's a little pale. Oh, no. Don't start taunting. Oh shit. Okay, so I don't really remember the controls. <laughs> They're mostly the same, but... I, I have playtested this before I did go live, and I could not for the life of me remember how to grapple. Oh shit. Oh god. Shit. Ah. Uh, come on, Randy. There we go. Who? Kachow! Give him the Ram Jam! <laughs> oh, God. Prove that you're not washed up. 
Yeah, Alex, wanna play Nintendo? <laughs> oh no. I can't really do much in this. There we go. Oh, beautiful. I was spamming buttons like anything. Okay. Let him come to me. I'll take a count out. I don't give a shit. We've seen more than Come one superstar on. taken out here on a stretcher. Oh shit. Boy, there's not a lot of finesse to Shad's style, is there? Not oh. at all. And that has here we go. To this big from Give him the ram jam. <laughs> Every move is the ram jam. Ram jam forever and always. Did you ever think oh you god. You know what? I should have given him Tommy Dreamer's moveset as well. Shit. Me too. It almost makes it worth having to sit next to you and listen to those corny expressions. Come on. What the heck is a government mule anyway? It's what you get beat like. We're in the middle of a slobber knot. And if you don't have the guts to stick around, you might run like a scalded Shit. dog with a case of the limber tape. All right, all right, enough. There we go. Oh, oh yes, giving the ram jam. For or Boom. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, what, what? Oh, yeah. Oh, he blocked. Shit. Oh no. Taking it easy on each other tonight. That's not what they signed up for, King. And quite frankly, I think these fans would be disappointed if they didn't go off. Get up. Well, that's easy for the fans to say. They Ooh, it was a nice snap, man. No, but they spend their hard earned. Okay, so this game does a weird thing where the R stick is like basically your grapple. Which is strange. Like you feel like it should be X, but it's actually the R stick. I don't it just It's odd. I have no idea. Okay, hold on. L1, L2, store your fighting style. Sure. Right oh god! <laughs> Shit. Have you checked your wallet and watch lately? That was like a fucking rock DDT. Oh god. Alright, everything's going wrong now. This is a clinic for Sunday Night Heat. My god, Stevie Richards would be fucking jealous right now. Tommy Dreamer would be jealous. He was a Sunday Night Heat special. Pretty sure you can change it so it's with circle. Can I change it right now? Control type. Oh, uh... Mm, what if I go control type B? Is that... Let's try that. This is a mistake, JR. Everyone knows that overconfidence costs superstars matches. That might be Oh no, that's not. All I see is a very confident superstar who's got Nope, that's not it. That's just switching the That's switching the D-pad and the L stick. <laughs> so I have to move with the D-pad. I don't really want to do that. It's not a PS1 game. <laughs> I think I might have to switch it back at the menu. Some of the people all of the time, and all the people some of the time, but there's no fooling the WWE fans at all. Type C. Yeah, I've only got the two options. It's annoying. HUD? No. Yeah, we got nothing. I've only got the two options. It must, maybe it's, uh, maybe it's at the main menu. Oh god. Yeah, so the R stick is your grapple, which is not what I'm used to at all. Look at the way these superstars have been going after each other. Ooh, arm drag. That's for sure. We knew we were going to see a heck of a match, but this might turn out to be... No, go ahead and say it, JR. All right, I will. I think this one's got all the makings. Of a different game, I think. Maybe. 
Oh, too easy. Get him up. Alright, go to the top. Give him the ram jam. Oh, that was my finisher! <laughs> Shit! Ah, oh, damn it. You know, a lot of people accuse Shad of perpetuating a negative stereotype. Oh, God. Big Shad's an extremely charismatic and talented competitor. I don't see any negative to him whatsoever. Come on. Obviously, you've never done business with him then. He's a tag team wrestler. I can take him out. <laughs> Here we go. He's going up. This could backfire. Nope. Oh, there it is again. <laughs> Try one more time. Here he goes. Up the turnbuckle. This could be really good or really bad. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, my stamina is low. Oh wait, I could pin. Well, from the looks of things, it's not hard to tell how Pick this is gonna go. What are you talking about, King? I think this is still an extremely competitive match that could go. There we go. You know, JR, it's obvious that the climbing up the turnbuckle isn't bad. It's all the ways you could come down that hurt. Oh <laughs> shit. Snap man. Oh no. If any superstar shows the slightest hint of weakness, they've lost the match. Oh no. I think I did not. Fight him down. Fight him. Fight. Come on, Ram Jam. Ram Robinson. Robbie the Ram, Randy Ram Robinson. Come on. There we go. Oh, Dragon Sleeper. Nice. Oh. Corkscrew, leg twist, whatever. <laughs> oh no, he crotched me. Holy shit. No, don't beat me. No, I don't know how to get out of submission. Uh, oh, I've got to do the combination. <laughs> I don't know the combination. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, I didn't win. Okay, it's good. All right, snap, man. Come on. I want that elbow drop. I think going oh, stop getting up. <laughs> he keeps getting up straight away. This is a risky move. It could prove to oh, be no. Disastrous. This is it. This is it. Oh, no. <laughs> that was my finisher. Shit. Shit. Man, is there even going to be anything left? Oh no. By the time they're done, not Tap. Their way, King. Tap. Everything they came in here with tonight is going to be left in that ring, mark my words. I hope these fans Oh, there we go. JR. Perfect. Got out of it. Oh right no. Nutty, it's finally here. Ah! <laughs> Come on. The first wrestling game on the PS3. <laughs> Alright, arm drag. Rest in peace, Shad, Shad as well. Yeah, the first wrestle we get is the one that had tragically passed away. Who the hell is Green Paint Man? He's Randy the Ram Robinson. <laughs> Mickey Rourke. The wrestler. <laughs> as best as I could create him. Go for the pin! Tap for finisher. You've got to ask yourself, Come on. Spear! Will these yes! Pin! Yes! Debut match! Debut! Fuck yeah! <laughs> God damn! I don't know. I don't know what his standing finisher was. Oh God! Watch it! Watch with the 
<laughs> watch the N word, Nutty. All right, confirm. Oh, my fo my Nokia is blowing up. Knock me out in this training. Let's see you get Fusigo. I want you to win this training match by KO. Show me you're tough. I'm not impressed. Sorry, but that's not what you should be doing. Oh, did I do that wrong? <laughs> I did not read the text. Uh, training exercises. Work on building your strength using this training regimen. Perform set amount of ultimate control grapple successfully. Oh, God damn it. All right, whatever. Sure, we'll do some of these. <laughs> but uh, that's his locker room. It's very badass. Shady repair shop. Oh, yeah. Where they repair, like, fucking... Like, your cracked iPhone screen. <laughs> it's in, like, the middle of, like, a shopping mall. And this is, like, the back room. Okay. I think it said we needed to do, like... I'll be counting on a Rey Mysterio mask for future stream sessions. Uh, whenever it's a wrestling a stream, I'll, I'll pull out the mask. I'm also wearing wrestling tights as well. <laughs> Alright. Legit wrestling tights. Oh shit. Oh my god! <laughs> That's horrible. This isn't a match. I'm meant to be, like, doing a... Whoopsie. I'm meant to be doing a, uh... Ooh, nice. Like a strength One. challenge. Two. Let's go up again. Nice. Um. Whoa, nice move. Whoopsie. Um. Oh shit. What difficulty is on? It's on normal. It's been a long time since I've played this, and trying to remember the controls is a little hard. Uh, it's weird that the R stick is like a grapple. Um, because I used to play this on PSP. I did not play this on a PlayStation. Like an, or an actual PlayStation console. Not the fucking handheld one. But yeah, I played this on the PSP, which had different controls. Because <laughs> it only had one, one joystick, if you could call it that. Pretty much all the same. Yeah, they are. Oh god. Okay. Again, I'm meant to be doing some, like, strength grapple. But I have no idea how to execute it. Because I haven't watched any tutorial. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't do that right, did I? No, I did not. Check out the crowd signs. I was able to pick some of them. <laughs> the, the game uh, gives me an option to pick some of them. Training exercise. No result. Failed. <laughs> did nothing of strength whatsoever. What's this? Doesn't impress in first heat match, you son of a bitch. Okay, we can bring it back. Let's go back to... Let's simulate. Let's go to the next week. 
Um, we're back on heat. Oh god, I didn't see... Oh no. I didn't see what coach's thing was. Is the usual gang here? I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Uh, Rick's here. Also, we had Drifty stop by earlier. Hmm. All right. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm gonna do a match. Let's see what the result is. Whew. We'll find out what the result is. Bang, bang, bang. The following contest is I need to get him his fur waistcoat. If it even has on one in this game. From Jersey City, New Jersey. Well, it's Sheep Wool. Hell of a lime green get up. And JTG again. Well, his tag partner this time. Okay. So I think he wanted me to knock him out. We want he wanted us to win by KO, not pin. So we need to do that. So we'll try and do that. At the very least. I feel like we can knock him out. JT JTG isn't that tough. He's not that tough. Oh god. He heard me. Can he capitalize on it? Oh, leg sweep. Fuck yeah. He reversed it. There we go. And again, go up top. He's going up. This could backfire. Ah, oh, <laughs> nice. God, knock out the ref. You know what? That's actually a good idea. JTG Hold on. on this is gonna be a rope break. Shit. I'm sure you're not Whoa. The only one. He's got that was quick. Business, does old JTG. That went nowhere. Hold on. Targeting indicators on. Oh, there we go. Now we just need to learn how to target people. Uh, that, that, not that. That's a taunt. We just need to learn how to taunt. Well, not taunt, target. Triangle? No. Oh, there we go. Uh, there we go. Oh no. I've only got like two seconds to get a weapon. How do I get out of the ring? How do I get out of the ring? <laughs> Shit. I never learned how to exit the ring. Uh. Well, I knocked him down. But I never learned how to exit the ring. I think it's L1, but I don't... I don't think that was working. Why does X not do anything? 
The X button is literally useless. It doesn't do anything. What? <laughs> what is this control scheme? All right, there we go. JTG's not just a talented athlete. He's also an honor student. I th There's all sorts of crazy stuff. There we go. And all of it can inflict a lot of damage on an opponent. Dude. Uh, hold on. Let me whack the ref. Ah. <laughs> Come on, ref. Any superstar shows the slightest no. kind of weakness, they've lost the match. That's for sure. No matter how beat up you are, you can't He's leaning on the ropes, so I was like, oh, maybe I can glitch him. And that's easier said than done, JR. The human body can only absorb so Oh much shit, much. don't hit him. All right. You would DQ. Well, I get DQ if I hit the ref with the chair. All right, I find I want I, I've got the chair though ready, so I can hit JTG with it. Okay. Now we just need to hit the ref. <laughs> Elbow his knees. <laughs> Come on. All right, there we go. Pick the chair up. Pick the fucking chair up. Ah. What's the button to pick it up? Fuck. Square. I'm hitting square. <laughs> Head. The square just fucking strikes. Oh no. It's alright. I'll knock him out again. It's fine. God, we're learning as we go here. We're learning as we go. Alright, the ref is surely back in. Yep. Come here, Mike Kyoto. There we go. Oh no! The referee's been knocked out. That oh, shit. can't be good. Are you kidding? Now anything goes. It doesn't get any better than that, JR. Circle, triangle, R1, L1. What the fuck? How do you pick the chair up? <laughs> I tell you, King. Square. No Something. How these superstars can maintain this intensity. <laughs> It doesn't help that I'm out of stamina too. Why is Randy limping? I think it's stamina. I think I'm out of stamina. And that's why I don't think there can be any doubt in anyone's mind that the superstars of the WWE are the greatest athletes in the world. Oh no. No, that's not even your move. <laughs> Stop wrenching. I'm just meant to move it. That's probably just gas. Oh, Roper, I can't go on. Well, I did have some good old Oklahoma barbecue before tonight's show, but I don't think that's it. There we go. Alright. Sweet dreams. Pick the fucking chair up. Oh, come on. <laughs> you pick it up. What is the controls? Oh, there's no controls thing. Match rules, no. God damn it! I just want to fucking knock him out. He's always giving shout outs to his friend. Have you ever given a shout out? Well, you know, once I dropped a bowling ball to my foot, and I screamed like a pig under a gate. Holy That's shit! About as close as I've ever come to a shout out. No more. Says press X. I've been hitting X. <laughs> I'll try X. I tell you, King. Sometimes I I'll listen to Doctor Google. All right. Watching these superstars compete. I know what you mean, Jr. I don't think most people appreciate what incredible athletes these WWE superstars really right. are. Get out of the ring. Has some excellent conditioning to be able to do what they do. Well, that's the name of the game, Jr. Whoa. Gotta keep moving. No dog ever peed on. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> Pick it. Ah, oh, come on, ref. <laughs> Shit. Oh, no. There goes the referee. Oh, man. No. Ah, 
my god. This is the hardest I've ever worked just to fucking hit someone with a chair. Oh my god. I talked to these superstars backstage. Oh, damn it. Match, and I don't think I've ever seen competitors so ready to get it on. And that's coming through loud and clear here tonight in this match. They're not taking it easy on each other either. It's been said a million times, but I'll say it again. This isn't ballet. Ruthless aggression is the name of the game. Get the chair. Up. Oh, no. Oh, just keep headbutting him. Randy the Ram Jam him. Ugh. <laughs> Concussion. Attacks. CTE attacks. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> But I'd have to get my head out I mean, that'll knock him out, right? It's rough to get to a point in a match where you want to keep going, but you just <laughs> see Charles left. Robinson running at the ring. <laughs> Ready to take his place. Alright. Yeah. <laughs> this is there we go. Oh, no. <laughs> Wait. Oh. I should have restarted. Fuck. Alright, it finally was like, alright, that's it, you're doing this on purpose. Shit. <laughs> oh no, coach is gonna yell at me now. Good enough! <laughs> Even if you can't always win, I'm gonna keep you around, Raw, but first one more heat match so I can calculate your starting salary. Yeah! I hit the Reddit for enough and coach is like, sure, you got a, you got a job, kid. Uh, tap out training match. Listen up, you've had to dominate your opponents. So let's see if you have it in you. What do I expect winning by forcing a tap out? Okay. Well, I've already missed that opportunity. Let's skip to the next week. <laughs> I'm meant to do- I know I'm meant to do, like, training stuff, but... Ah. <laughs> ah. Oh, Kenny Dykstra. Oh, wait. Oh, I didn't see what coach wanted me to do. God damn it. Alright, well, we're gonna do... I did hit more moves on the ref. The ref copped it. Alright, perfect. Very good. Very, very good. Okay. The following contest is scheduled for a one fall. On the way to the ring. Beautiful. From Jersey City. There's our boy. The tap out thing I think was meant to be for last week's match. And I didn't read what coach sent me. So we're just going into this blind again, because I keep forgetting, and it doesn't let me go back and check. So fuck it, we'll try, <laughs> try again. All these Steve Austin facts. Which I think we need to, we actually need to unlock a lot of these Hall of Famers. We don't have any of the WWE legends. Although nowadays, WWE Legends is literally anyone. <laughs> you, you can be in the company in the past and be considered a legend. It means literally nothing. At least at this period, it felt like they held it in some esteem. Like, my god, you're a legend. Hacksaw Jim Duggan, you are a legend. Now go out there, swing a 2x4. For those die-hard American fans. Oh, Kenny, no. Kenny, no! Alright. Every superstar on the roster has had to make more sacrifices than any other professional... Exit the ring! Exit the ring! Oh, damn it. Oh, 
Ah, oh, the ref's down. Kenny's come so far Kenny, you bastard. We could be looking at a future WWE champion right here. I wouldn't doubt it. No wonder your push stopped. Decades of competition ahead of And Rated RKO didn't want you in the group. <laughs> That's a deep cut. Superstar shows the slightest hint of weakness. This is a good they elbow drop. Win. Solid That's elbow sure. drops, Kenny. No matter how beat up you are, you can't ever let your opponent know. Come on, Kenny. And that's easier said than done. Let me up. The human body can only absorb so much. Oh, I've got a minute. Oh shit, I've got a minute on the clock. I need to beat him. I just realized. I guess that's the, that's the challenge. Beat him in like 2 minutes. That's not going to happen. I haven't won a match here on Sunday Night Heat yet. I had a feeling their paths were going to cross sooner or later. And I'm glad I'm here to see. Me too. It almost makes it worth having to sit next to you and... Come on. Up the turnbuckle isn't bad. Oh, oh no. The 40 seconds. He's obviously not feeling too threatened, JR. Boom. He's not smart enough to realize how dangerous his opponent really is. Yes! <laughs> Pin him! Hook the leg! Ah, oh, you idiot. No, hook the leg! Ah! No, I'm out of time. This crowd has decided to exercise Damn it. free speech. God bless the first of Fuck. I failed all three matches <laughs> on heat. I could not get anything going. Randy the Ram off to a rough start in his career. Holy shit. Well, at least Sandman beat Gregory Helms. <laughs> oh god. It's all good. We'll try again. Ah, oh, here we go. <laughs> We're meeting Vince in the ring. In an empty arena. And there's music playing. So Vince is like a weird sociopath playing commentary and fan sounds in an empty arena. <laughs> oh, ruthless aggression in 2007. Like Roddy Piper, Steve Austin, The Rock, and many more. That's your responsibility, not mine. All I can do is give you the chance. It's up to you to make the impact. I want you to make it back here to the showcase over the immortals. I'd like to think that he got the production crew to make the WrestleMania 23 set, play a bunch of audio tracks. The crowd's noises, commentary, all that in ambient noise in the arena. And then bring him out to this scenario where he's just yelling at him like, I want ruthless aggression. You're going to ECW. <laughs> Is that where I'm going? ECW? I need to charge my controller. All right. Hell yeah. Me and Bulls Mahoney. <laughs> Is that where I'm headed? And some So you want to be a championship contender, huh? Well, that's a relatively simple process. 
I love the talking to smile in the current game. Thing. The respect of your fellow superstars should also be one of your top priorities, whether you earn it from them or okay. you beat them. This is the coach, Miss Ringman's executive assistant in charge of Raw. I've got my eye on you as a potential number one contender, but there are several superstars between you and okay. the top. Um... Why did the ECW thing play? Yeah, I'm on ECW. Oh. Oh, okay. This is just like... Oh, do some training. Hold on. Training exercise skill improvement? Microphone skill training. On-camera training. Pain management skills. Fan favorite training. I need money, apparently. <laughs> Can we go to SmackDown so we could have a six-man tag matches every day? Well, we already picked Raw. I think we're already signed to Raw. Wait, let's invade today's show. <laughs> let's invade ECW. What is this card? Alright, so Lashley... So Lashley's pulling double duty. He's facing Elijah Burke in the opener. And then he's going to face Marcus Corvard in the main event. That's a hell of a match, though. Bobby Lashley and Marcus Corvon. Fuck yeah. Monty Brown. Very good. Sam Ansninski. Batista and Dreamer. Cena and CM Punk. This is a stacked ECW show. Uh, we gotta... We gotta fucking... We gotta interfere in the, uh, the main event, don't we? And Cena and Puck, I oh know, years before their classic of Money in the Bank. Just throwing Cena and Punk on a random ECW show. Hey! <laughs> there he is. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Bubbles Lashley. Alright, big Bobby Lashley. Now we've got sick... I love Marcus Corbon's entrance music. Hell yeah. It's so sassy. It's weird, like, funk music, but it actually... It, this is this more suits somebody who's like a baby face. The alpha male, hell yeah. Looking real jack, baby. <laughs> okay. Ah, <sighs> too bad Sabu. I don't think we have Sabu unlocked. I gotta unlock all these wrestlers. That's what I've gotta do. Okay. Big lashes, big Marcuses. Hold on, we're interfering at some point. Where am I? Where do I get to interfere? <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh no! <laughs> Shit! Ah. Wait, hold on. Superstars before the show, and they let me in on a little Grab a fucking weapon. Alright, there we go. This is a good idea. Oh, God damn it. Give me the chair. Huh? I'm not getting DQ'd. This is great. <laughs> Can I grab these steel steps? Hell yeah. 
I can do whatever I want. This is ECW. <laughs> oh, boom. Can I take about these announce tables? Hell yeah. Let me get one of the wrestlers. <laughs> Marcus. Oh shit. It's gonna. Oh god. Oh fucking hell. Reverse suplex. Holy shit, Bobby. The strength. Alright, here we go. Yeah, alright. Why not? <laughs> All right, he's all yours, Corvon. Come on. I think everyone's gonna leave the arena with a smile. No, 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 don't walk away. On the face of this superstar. Yeah, that 50 cents will get you a cup of coffee. Oh, I'm gonna run out of time. Ah, damn it. Well, what a night of action, and I have a feeling the best is still. Should get more heat. Well, I made Bobby lose by count out. So there you go. Not by DQ, by count out. Okay, very good. Got some good hate. Marcus Corvon wins. The way it should be. Imagine Vince watching this back like... What the fuck's Green Man doing? Plus three pay, uh, fan popularity. Plus 25% fatigue. Oh, that's probably not good, right? Okay. I guess that cost fatigue doing that. Okay. So, you can kind of take it... Health report. Oh, injury frequency. Okay, that's not good. So, I can potentially get injured... If I keep going here. Weekly contract price. I'm being paid two grand a week. That's... That's fucking good. <laughs> that's decent money. Uh, I've got no merchandise, though. Uh, injuries okay. Popularity, 31. That's a little bit low. Popularity is pretty shit. I've won one match, lost another. Okay, sure. Let's get started. Let's simulate to SmackDown. Events and activities. Autograph signing. Villain movie. <laughs> Alright, let's do an autograph signing. Simulating. How did it go? Did anyone show up? Plus one familiarity. <laughs> nice. Alright. Day off, day off. Next week. Alright, we're back to Raw. The only reason he didn't come to rescue the show was because of his quads. Oh yeah, if he ran down that ring... To stop me from fucking over Lashley, both quads would have been torn. Now that you're officially entered, oh, Maria Canellis. <laughs> consider yourself to be the new face of this brand. Uh. What? Yes. <laughs> Does it include housing? Uh, no, that's extra. I need to hold a title to be housed. I'm homeless at the moment, but I'm getting two grand a week. I don't know why I don't rent an apartment, but... What do you think? <laughs> this guy is good. Yeah, is he gonna make out with Maria? <laughs> Ew. What's wrong with Get away from her. Talk about taking liberties. Oh, God. 
Looks to me like he was damn sure trying to send a message. Yeah, wow. But who exactly was the message for? Did Maria enjoy any of that? <laughs> She's going to end up with Sean now. Well, there you go. It was the most Shawn Michaels thing ever. It was kind of. All right, so we're facing Randy Orton. Yes, we're going to play. I'm going to get my ass kicked, but sure, why not? Randy Orton. Randy the Randy Orton. Terrific. Welcome to Raw, where Backlash is... Oh, am I going to beat him up? This is Jim Ross, here with Jerry the King Lawler at ringside. What? Why are you shaking hands with him? You're going to be in the ring with him in a second. That's right, and it's all about the most important thing in this business. Respect. The respect of the fans and the locker room is something... Yeah, money on Randy is, uh... That's for sure. Is a safe if you bet. Can't get them to give it to you, Until I learn the controls. Like money on the opponent. Why are they pointing and looking at me? <laughs> okay. Fuck Jeff Hardy. Piece of shit. This is actually the part that I did like, these loading screens, because it would actually give you kind of quick stat. It will give you quick facts, and it would give you, like, all the titles that they held. And because I wasn't that really familiar with WWE, like, prior to, like, 04 at the time, when I saw all those, like, lists of titles, I was like, holy shit, that's a lot of titles. Some of these titles don't even exist anymore. <laughs> And there's no way to, like, go back and watch a lot of stuff, so, at least back then, in the mid-2000s. But, I don't know, it kind of always seemed like this far away sort of thing that I might I maybe see on YouTube a little bit, but that's about it. Jeff Hardy was like, who the fuck is this one of you, Dolph Ziggler? Yeah! <laughs> Tommy Dreamer's entrance! Nice. Okay. Alright, I'll play the song just because Nutty, you get to hear this, you get to hear his track. The beautiful golden shower. Nothing you can say. <laughs> nothing you could say, Nutty. There's absolutely nothing you could say. I miss that raw set. I love that fucking weird angular Titan Tron. Hopefully Twitch won't block it. I don't think they would. I don't think this is copyrighted. The funny thing is, WWE don't really care about their own music. For some reason. I don't know why. At least some of the content that I've made on YouTube and had WWE tracks in it, they've, they haven't given a shit. That are in Bat Nye. If you show any of their footage though, they will fucking come at you with hellfire. <laughs> they will not let allow you to show any of their footage. But their music, they don't care. I keep talking over the song as well. Hey! a fucking badass song. God damn it. It's a good song. It's a very good song. <laughs> Did you know Kelly Kelly appeared with several other WWEs in the Timberland music video? I did. I remember that music video. Career Highlights performs Kelly's expose on ECW. <laughs> so she strips. That's her career highlight. Okay. And then Mike Knox comes in and says, Uh-uh. Don't do that anymore. Come here, Randy. <laughs> Watch out. 
Oh shit. Oh god. He's gonna be very good, isn't he? Yeah, they were definitely not safe for work. Absolutely not. And she was very young for her age. Oh, yeah, very young at that point as well in her career. I'm pretty sure she was like 19. Like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, no. This is still anybody's match. I'd like to see things from your perspective, oh, God. Remember Candace. Candace Michelle? Sure. Yeah. And Lord knows it's been up there for so long. I do remember her. That that be no easy yeah. Sure I mean, a lot of them were, pretty much. Oh, nice. Oi! Oh, fucking ref. Just because he's Randy Orton. <laughs> You can call a low blow, yeah? Oh, beautiful. Cover. Oh, that's a good cover. Letting him have it. Alright, I reckon I can win this. I reckon I can. I believe in myself. S surprisingly, I do. Shit. We just need to give him the ram jam. Which, by the way, I tried to give myself the diving headbutt. Uh, could not find it in the moveset. And all I could think of was, I wonder why. I wonder why the diving headbutt is not... A selectable move in this game. This came out... It might have been a few months. It might have been three or four months. After said incident. Ooh, nice swinging neckbreaker. Oh, God damn it. I wanted to pick... Because I, I needed a move that looked like the Ram Jam. But there's no diving headbutt, so the best I could settle for was an elbow drop. Which is all I really do. <laughs> Let's do it again! Oh shit. Oh, God damn it, stop low blowing me! Trying to get a power slam, that was good. Oh yeah. Or a spine buster, maybe. <laughs> God damn the reversals. Randy, damn it. Shit. Oh. No. <laughs> Come on, I, if I beat Orton here, that puts me in a very... This is a former Intercontinental Champion at this point. Uh, I don't think he's won the world title yet. Oh, he may have... Uh, I think he might have had one WWE title reign. Oh, wait, no, he had the world title. Never mind. What the fuck am I talking about? He won the world title in 04. <laughs> Former world champion Randy Orton. If I beat him here, there's no stopping Randy the Ram Robinson. Can you believe we actually get paid to do this job, JR? No. It's like a dream come true, King. Beautiful. Cover. Come on, JR. You know it. And here's the pin. Ooh, not a good one. Not a very impactful one. Another elbow, I say. He's the Another elbow. What's he up to? Ooh, drops the axe handle. Oh, beautiful swing net breaker. Go back up. There's no room for error when you're on the top rope. Yes! Cover! Can his opponent kick out of this fitting predicament? Ooh, alright. We're getting closer. 
Shit. Uh oh. Oh no. You gotta stop this guy before he really gets going. I don't think that's going Break to out of it. He's built yes. Go back up. <laughs> he loves these elbows. Does Randy. Beautiful. I just realized this is two Randys facing each other. Tap for finisher. Give him the spear. Give him the ram. This is the ram. He calls it the ram. Oh, beautiful. Oh, come on. That was it. That was it. Holy shit. Almost beat a world champion. There we go. Pin. We could have a pinball here, JR. Come on. <sighs> Son of a bitch. I'm going to keep going for the pin. These two He's got his opponent in a pinning predicament. Oh, beautiful arm drags. That's why I said I have my money on Randy on this one. Hell no. I can fucking do it. <laughs> Any superstar shows the slightest hint of weakness. Oh shit. That's for sure. No matter how I can do it. Are, you can't ever let your I just can't let him get the RKO on me. And that's easier said than done, JR. The human body oh, you bastard. So oh, you bastard. Oh, break out of it. You're both Randy's, that's why. <laughs> there you go. Until someone's I didn't pick up on that. I did now. Because you told me. Chops. Chops. Oh, man. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Oh, that's fucking shit. Alright, all these quick takedowns, though, they're, they're working. That was beautiful. Shit. This is raw action at its finest. Break out. That's why raw. Oh no. Sports entertainment. You got that right, JR. You're not going to suppose. That was a very amateur wrestling move by is Randy it really Orton. Is good or really bad? Oh no. <laughs> He's got the RKO stored. No! <laughs> Shit! No! Get up! You idiot! Oh, no. This could be a pinball. Kick out! Kick out! <sighs> you know what? That's a fair showing. That's a fair showing by the rookie. Randy, he took Randy Orton to his limit. Hit him with the speed. Hit him with the ram, and it didn't work. <laughs> right on time. We're gonna go to college. <laughs> all right, all good, dude. On, Thanks for sticking around. Oh fuck off, Jeff Hardy. <laughs> Why are you in this equation? Sean, saving my life, thank you. Jeff Hardy and Randy Orton on the same page. Who would have thunk it? Terrific. 10 out of 10 acting worthy of a Bollywood film. I think so too. Amazing cutscenes. Alright, perfect. Saving my bacon. You couldn't take care of your own business. So my pork is saved. Two other contenders. So Where's the beef? And you're welcome. Uh, express gratitude. I'll keep him on my good side. Very good. All right, let's invade ECW. <laughs> Uh, let's... 
Oh. We keep fucking with Lashley. <laughs> this was the worst thank you or apology request ever. <laughs> yeah, I know. It kind of was. Should we keep messing with Lashley? Or should we go after Triple H? Let's go after the big dog. I think we should go after Triple H. I want Sandman to win. I help the ECW Originals. Hunter just want to see Sandman's intro. Well, we know what Triple H's intro is, pretty much. This is always- this is literally the same for the past, like, ten years. In every video game. <laughs> it didn't change at all. Well, starts in 10 minutes and it's a 5 minute walk. Alright, here's Sandman's. Here's Sandman's one. He doesn't come through the crowd, does he? Oh no, he does, maybe. And the opponent, the Sandman. He does! Not really the crowd, just kind of an exit area, but yeah. Oh, beautiful. Does he bust himself open? Uh, his forehead's clean. Sick. <laughs> yeah, he's coming through the crowd. I liked his entrance music. I thought it was pretty good. I mean, it's basically just Jim Johnson doing a lot of distortion on the guitars, but that's about it. Yeah, very good. Alright. Guy gets in the ring already concussed. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly the Sandman. Oh, all good, Nutty. Take it easy. Alright. So we're going to stop Triple H from beating the Sandman. Uh, I'll just grab a chair and just hope for the best. Although I'm pretty sure this costs fatigue, so we'll see if I end up injured after this. We'll find out. Alright, Randy, where are you? you and I both know what's coming up, and there he is. <laughs> their money's worth There's our boy. Oh, I'm stuck in a loop. Alright, there we go. Alright, there we go. Let's grab a weapon. Come here. Ah, yeah, well, you know oh, damn it. I mean, I can smack the ref. There we go. Fuck you. <laughs> Give me the chair. That would be a really good time to start Whoopsie. <laughs> Shit. I'm just swinging. I'm just swinging. Nah, I'd be too tempted to jump in that ring and start choking Oh, I broke the chair. Shit. Let's get another one. If we can. Yes, we can. Fucking Jesus Christ. Oh, there we go. Van Daminator! <laughs> yes! Grab the sledgehammer. Oh, sorry, apropos. Fuck yeah. Come here. 
Oh, no. Oh, you son of a bitch. You can't use that. Oh, no. Pick it up. Why did Sandman just not get in the ring? That's his own fault. That is absolutely his own fault. God damn it, Sandman. Oh, God. Alright, well... Folks... That's gonna do it for tonight. <laughs> it's been a weird stream. Um, but it's been fun playing SmackDown vs. Raw 2008. I'll be back... Uh, tomorrow night, as always, 10 p.m. Uh, if you haven't already, hit the follow button or subscribe button, depending on what you're watching. I stream on Twitch and YouTube. Um, but yeah, tomorrow night I'll be back on, I think, the Call of Duty train. I'm thinking maybe World at War? Maybe? I don't know. We'll find out. Uh, but yeah, if you like what you see here, stick around, join the community. Um, but yeah, guys, take care. 